Hi, this is Zek, co-founder of User, and welcome on board. I am going to show you the first steps you need to take right after you sign in. User is a computer vision-based automation tool designed to automate your repetitive tasks, ideal for test automation and RPA. We currently support both Mac and Windows platforms. With User, you can automate any desktop or web application. Basically, you can automate anything visible on your screen. In just two minutes, I will show you how to create your first automation scenario. This will be the quickest automation scenario you have ever created. Then in the next video, we will run the scenario in Windows and Mac. If you have a Mac and Windows versions of your applications, you can use the same exact scenario in both platforms. Let's get started. When you first log into user, you are going to see your previously saved scenarios. In this tutorial, we will go to getting started folder and create our new scenario. Our scenario is we are going to open Chrome then go to Wikipedia, click text English and then login and then click login. Let's see what's going to happen. It will open Wikipedia, click English, then click login and then type username, password and click login. This is our automation center and let's write our steps our scenario name wikipedia then we will go to scenario editor page here is where we define our scenario step by step first step is open browser chrome wikipedia then click text English, then login, and after this we hit the login button, we are going to click and write into the fields which says username, and I'm going to type my username is user, and then also same thing for the password test one two three my secret password there is no such user this is just for the sake of the automation scenario so uh, and then the last step is to click again login Yes, here is like this. There's another login here, but this is the button one. So I'm going to choose button here. Okay, save. So our first scenario is ready. We created our scenario, but we are not done yet. There are other ways which I would like to share with you. First one is code editor modes. This is one of my favorites. Here is actually just you can type your scenarios very easily if you know the syntax which you will learn in time very quickly this is very easy you can actually just like write your scenarios in notepad and then copy them here as a again you don't need user up and running on your environment you also don't need the wikipedia on the background running and one another way of creating scenarios is this we have generative tests assistance what i mean by that is i created the scenario here i will copy paste this is just like your everyday language and then i will say generate and our generative test assistant going to create those steps like this to be honest it does not work 100% all the time but when you are starting it is very helpful to make your first steps yeah so we are done and the next step is to run the scenario i will see you later